Greetings, lords and ladies, Kaiser here, and welcome to another episode of our Bannerlord campaign. Now then, I know what you must be thinking. You didn't move an inch, did you? And, in fact, no. No, I did not. Uh, I did not go about, like I said in the, the at the end of the previous episode, to go about and do some tournaments and whatnot. Uh, the reason being is that I thought to myself that for, at least for newer players, uh, these first steps might actually be the most interesting ones, and then seeing how to build up um, from those. But, on that note, I do invite you to leave a comment down below and let me know what you think of this like i do know that not everything should be on camera of course um as we travel along you know i will be doing cuts as i i don't know for instance go into the taverns get uh to do the uh possible uh, games there or if there's a tournament and we've seen way too many already i'll cut that out as well and things like that um but should i keep at least most things um on camera the reason being is i don't want too much time to go by without us doing something that's uh, that's the thing right i don't want too much to happen around the world without us um either noticing or affecting it in any possible way uh or do you think that I should not care about the time as much and actually do more off camera? Do uh, actually go and do um, like tournaments, focus a little bit more on the just smaller battles, getting our renown up, uh, as well as, of course, um, doing the little bit of uh, blacksmithing that we'll be doing uh should i just not care about the time and do those things off camera and just do like the larger battles the bigger things on camera let me know uh let me know down below but for this one uh i didn't really move much out of onira um i actually stayed here and did um quite a few actually um arena battles uh and i just wanted to show you guys i'll really uh just the beginning steps uh if anybody would be interested in doing this essentially not wanting the time to pass but still wanting to make some money granted it's not the fastest way to make money uh you essentially get 250 um 250 denars for every victory you get but i didn't realize this until i tried um there is actually a way to slightly cheese the system in the uh arena fights on how to increase your chances of victory so you'll always spawn in this uh spot right here from what i've noticed at least um i've never had a spawn anywhere else in the arena just chuck a couple of these at our enemy here Okay, there isn't anybody coming towards us. Uh, not interested in his bow and arrow. The tactic really is just to stay right here in this little cove. <laughs> um, essentially, make your way from the beginning position. Oh, that guy's gonna chuck something at me. Uh, essentially, come from the beginning position into this alcove right here. Um, the thing is. Unlike in Warband, where the AI essentially just randomly decides that all seven remaining combatants in the arena should just charge at you and nothing else, uh, the Bannerlord uh, AI actually um, goes for the nearest opponent. Uh, now, this is both a good thing and a bad thing, of course. A good thing because you can do exactly this, hide, <laughs> and let the enemy uh have at each other uh on the other hand this does also mean that the ai will not just you know walk past you to get to uh to a different opponent so you can't really uh cheese that so eventually an enemy will make their way to you just okay maybe if he takes him down that's fine He's not going to be able to attack us because the wall actually does prevent him from swinging his uh, long pole arm. Yeah, just like that. He said, like, if there was an opponent in front of us and we went for a swing like that, the environment actually stops you from swinging. And I love that. I love that. There. And now we have a shield. We have a sword. The two things... I always like to have when I'm in this little alcove. Granted, that guy, the reason that guy didn't come for us was because he was already focused on somebody else. 
Though if we showed ourselves after that somebody else was uh, defeated, he would definitely come for us. These guys essentially were just running towards the first opponent, noticed us, and came rushing at us. Uh, I'll make a cut right here. There's 10 more opponents remaining. Uh, shouldn't be too hard to win another one. And see you guys on the other side. There we go. Uh, plenty of bodies in the alcove, of course, but uh, <laughs> hey, a win's a win. And there we go. 250 uh, Denar's prize money. We're at 6,100. Um, yeah, we'll give our bruises some time to heal. We are actually not at 100%. We're at 93%. But with this little cheesy tactic, um, that doesn't really matter as much. We've already done the tablet game here. That I know. Um... We have done the trades we needed to do. Uh, let me just really quickly, I didn't actually check. We're good for a little bit of smithing, possibly. Do we have anything to smelt? We don't. We don't have anything to refine, either. Uh, so... I said that, but then I refined that. Never mind. Uh, there we go. We'll be leaving the town. Actually, let me just check real quick. Uh, go to the arena. By the way, in the arena also, you can speak with the tournament master and he can help you reset your traits. So if you're worried about which traits you're uh, selecting uh, when you level up, don't worry. Uh, you can actually reset those. It's going to cost quite a bit of money to reset them, but it is absolutely possible. Um, something you mentioned going on in nearby towns. Let's see. In Sironea uh, and Thykeon. So that's actually in the south, uh, if I remember correctly. Sironeo is in the north, right there, and there is... Wait, where? Okay, so both of the neighboring towns actually have a tournament going on right now. I was thinking that since I managed to get the money I managed to get, we could go back into the... Um, into the Asarai lands over here in order to recruit some additional cavalrymen. I would love to have like around 20 to 25. 25 because by the time they actually level up to the point where they're not going to be such easy targets to kill, uh, we're probably going to lose a few. Uh, but yeah, I will go down to the Asarai lands after we possibly go and try to win a tournament or two here. Having additional units will also make it possible for us to uh, fight some larger parties, not just these uh, small uh, 5 to 10 unit ones. Go to the arena and let's join the tournament. Let's join. And since we've already made some money, um, I don't feel as bad about possibly putting up a bet. A bet, sorry. A Batanian Thoroughbred. That's actually a very good horse and I would love to have one. Uh, it's a one-on-one-on-one. -on -one -on -one. Uh, these are usually the easiest. That one's more worrisome. But we'll see. Okay, I don't like that two of you are already running against me. Okay. But he is, of course, gonna swing at him first. We can use that. And then the other guy swings at him. All I do is defend. <laughs> Perfect, okay. But you seem to be the toughest out of all of them, so... Yeah, 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 even the... Head chop movements... Are doing little damage. 15 to 24 damage, but hey, he's down, there we go. We're through. We also gain a point in athletics. Oh, and I believe that in the very last fight uh, of the arena... Uh, I also gain another level, so I'll have to check... Uh, I forgot to check the character sheet there. Um, right, so we skip this round, skip it, skip it, and there we go. Joron is on our side. Okay, so we have the, um, whatchamacallit, uh, the actual, like, named NPC on our team. Should make things a little bit easier. Uh, we will, once again, do a bet. Oh, why do you have horses and I don't? Okay. No. Come on. Come on. Jesus, how tough are you? Uh, there's a cavalry unit coming. Okay. No, that's not okay.
come on. Cavalry unit, are you gonna do something? Get one. They're not getting any of them. Okay, I'm trying to time it. But the thing is, my shield is about to let... Give up. So it's now two versus three. At least our guys still have... Bow... I was gonna say both horses. Uh, that quickly changed. Come on, Jaron. Yeah, he's going down. Okay, actually, take, it took one down. Now, if this guy can defeat both of them, we're golden. If not, not really. He did hit him. Um, he is not very well armored, I will say that much. Okay, never mind. He's down. He is down. And we are out of the tournament. That is depressing. Uh, skip, skip, skip. Okay, so that didn't quite go the way we wanted it to. That was a very nice horse that we could have gotten, but oh well. Let's see if we have more luck. Actually, let me ha at least head in here, make that money back that we just lost. We lost 300. Uh, we're about to make 500 back, so I guess it could be much, much worse. Um, it could be so much better, though. Like that, Even if we didn't want to ride that horse, um, they're very expensive and uh, sell for quite a bit. All right, so I'll do another cut right here and see you on the other side. There we go. Another game won, another 500 dinars for us. So we actually made a profit there. <laughs> Alright, character, let's see. We have an additional skill we can put into something, or rather focus point. So let us see, let us see, let us see. Throwing, we're still good. I'm honestly thinking about putting a point maybe into one-handed, uh, just to speed up, because I'm, I'm sure I'm going to be doing arena uh, a bit more off-camera as well, just for, you know, the additional money, the additional levels as well. Um, and it might come in handy to uh, increase our strength with that. How's riding doing? Riding's doing fine. Athletics, we're also good. Smithing, definitely fine as well. Scouting, charm, steward, we're good. Uh, riding, we said we're good medicine as well yeah either i'm guessing either athletics or one-handed uh or just a bit more into steward once we get a, a couple of more men this is gonna go up um very very quickly which i would very much welcome and you know what sure i'll put another point into there there we go. And we're essentially just brute forcing the uh, one-handed weapon um, <laughs> upgrades, or rather level ups. Uh, over here, oh, that's the only thing that's happened, aka the looters are willing to join, but we don't want them to join. Alright, let's see if the Sironea Sironea gain a skill point of Stuart, there we go. Laska long knife was lost. All right, there arena tournament join, and let's have another go at this. Uh, this time it's already immediately four v four, and another four v four. Uh, it's not gonna be nice, but let's see if we can. Oh god, and they gave me a bow and arrow. That is the worst. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna be doing too hot with this no 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 oh that was a nice shot at the horse though got him nope oh there's a guy shooting at me from there that's not good I got him with a 39 Missed that one. Come on, I need one of you guys to die before you get to me. Alright. I don't know how he did that through his unit, but okay. Okay, that's dead. Now, how do I take care of you? Okay. Can I shoot you down? No! Yay, yay. No. K 
Okay. Actually... Can I get closer to him? You know what? If he's gonna do another run, uh, charge like that... Can possibly shoot him again. Nope. Defend. Okay. Nope. God, this is... <laughs> this is nerve-wracking. I won't lie. Okay, I'm gonna wait. This is stupid, but I'm gonna wait for him to charge at me. Yeah, no, that didn't work. Come on, this is gonna get this is getting silly now. Can I somehow force you like into a wall or something? Come on, come on, come on. Apparently not, because he's just running about. By running about I mean riding about. I mean, eventually I'm gonna run out of arrows, and that's <laughs> that's gonna be another problem. Wait, didn't one of you have like a shield? No, didn't work. Okay. Shield, 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 shield. He's got a shield. Gimme. Where is he? Okay. Okay. Do you have... Wait. Didn't you guys have javelins? That just disappeared on me. Ooh, that's a couch. Strike. Oh! I gotcha! I don't gotcha. Is there a... Oh! There's a javelin right there. No, 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 no. Okay. Pick up the javelins. Can I... No. Okay, got the horse. Where's my sword? Where is my sword? What the hell? That is... What? I was rolling my uh, mouse wheel so hard. What the actual heck? Did I? Sh wait. Was it because I held my sword when I picked up the javelins that I dropped my sword? Oh, now that is just wow. Wow. That is really all I have to say to that one. So... That's two lost. Mysia and Akalat. That is two lost tournaments this episode. Uh, Mysia? Maybe, maybe we'll have a little bit more luck there. I even forgot to do the um, tablet game over there. Okay, it's still evening, so we can still do the fight, I believe. Join the tournament. Okay, let's see. Please stop giving the four to four. I mean, I guess this is somewhat better. Uh, sure. Let's try and get those boots. Why not? Okay. It's not as bad. I was about to flip again that I got a bow and arrow. I did not. Let's help our guy here. Um, let's get some good throws possibly in. That was not a good throw. Ah, I'm missing. I'm missing so much. There, that's a hit. That's a hit. And I am out. Okay, sword out. Let's go. He's kind of ignoring me. Usually the AI does not do that much. Wait. You're not one of mine. Got it. Okay, that's dead. Uh, how are we doing? Three of our guys are still up. Well, two of our guys are still up. Okay. No horses behind me. That's good. That's the horse down. Okay. That's the red team out. Let's try and get the yellow team out. There we go. Okay, we're through. We're through. Blue and green are still in. Gonna get your horse... 
and he's gonna get you. Very nice. Okay, what's the second round? One on one on one, I like these. I I prefer these so much. <laughs> okay, who's coming at me? All of you again. Uh -huh. Run away! <laughs> Run away! Okay, good, good, good. The other dude focused on another person. So, as long as we win this one. And he wins that. Yeah, we're through. Okay, now, can I... Can I just wail on you? I think that should work. No. Not this time. Good god, how much HP do you have? Imperial Cataphract. Yeah, they're, they're, they're beefy. They're definitely beefy. Skip round, and I am against that same Imperial Cataphract. Once more, so here's a rematch. An opportunity for you, but a bigger opportunity for me. God. Can I... I was gonna say, can I swipe at him from the side or something? It's actually doing more damage than the straight-up head injury. Like, the reason I tried that was simply because, you know, his helm does look beefy. Okay. Last one, and we'll finally, finally win a tournament. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Yes. Like, as long as you just keep swiping at him, you should be fast enough. Should, mind you be fast enough to get him. There we go. Earnings from bets, very nice. We got the splint boots and we gained some renown. God, it just struck me. Yeah, that was six renown that we missed out on. Um, Right, quick visit to the tavern. There we go. Another 500 denot is right there. Like, if I ever lose this game, <laughs> then I'm gonna be upset. <laughs> Uh, alright. I mean, we can still ask the guy if there's any more tournaments anywhere. I won't be putting any more tournaments into the video itself. Uh, but just good to know. Sanopa and Argoron. But both of those are in the north, aren't they? We... I did say we want to head down south. Um, yeah, there's Argoron and Sanopa's right there. I mean, I guess all of the towns are kind of having a party right now. Uh, all of them are having tournaments. These are just the nearby ones. Um, you know what? Yeah, sure. Let's just head back to Sironea over there. We'll head back down south, uh, get ourselves some additional troops, um, see if we can maybe fight a few looters here and there. Come on, click on them. There we go. Back off, stranger. Unless you want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back off, back off. Nobody's backing off. And I will just immediately tell them to charge. A couple of them. Actually, no. All of them. No. This guy still doesn't have... Wait. Right. He's a companion. That's why he doesn't have javelins. <laughs> really? Didn't really do much there. Let's see if we can get a good shot in. That's a no. That's a yes. That was a leg. That looked like a headshot, but apparently he's just knocked out. Okay, one more. Ow. No, okay. Never mind. We did. Uh, wait. Oh, yeah, 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 never mind. Of course, one of them is ready to upgrade as well. Uh, we get, managed to capture another looter. Get some more stuff. Sino, Sironea, sorry, Sinopa is the other way. Uh, tavern visit here. There we go, and onwards we go. We got 8k. Um... So we should be able to get the amount of troops that we want to get out of this. Uh, we will, of course, find any uh, straggling looters and whatnot. A 12 unit. You know what? Sure, why not? You got a problem? Maybe. <laughs> Possibly. Okay, boys. Just going to order straight up attack and let's get in for a couple of... Javelin throws ourselves. J 
just like that. Oh, that was... Okay, that was a headshot. Very nice. Not sure why I aimed down where... Oh, Christ almighty, what was that? Something hit me in the leg. And I took a shit ton of damage. Missed that. Oh, there's another one right here. Okay. Last one. Okay. Now all that's left is... Spears. Head for this one. Not sure why we had it above our head. Yeah, like that. Okay, that was a little bit dangerous. What the? I was just gonna say, that was a little bit dangerous because I saw him aiming for me. There we go. That's one and one more. Somebody else gonna get him or should I? Won't lie, one more hit like the previous one and I'm gone. But, ow. Okay. <laughs> Let me just not do that then. <laughs> Rocks hurt for some reason. <laughs> and they hurt bad. Okay, two more prisoners. Excellent. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Let's see. Okay, so we got a sickle. We got a pickaxe. Both of those can be and will be um, smelted. Uh, we actually... Why didn't I actually put the splint boots that we got? Gosh darn, that would have been... that That's the leg armor that I was missing in this fight. <laughs> that's why I took as much damage as I did there, didn't it? Isn't it? Um, right, everything else can be taken. Let's just check our boy Hamindar over here. The fatherless. I don't know why I thought that said featherless at first, but fatherless. And let's see, is there anything... Actually, let's first check ourselves. We're not exactly highly upgraded either. Uh, anything that can upgrade our... Nope. Okay, what about here? You don't have any arm armor, so let's give you that. Wrap shoes, you have those. Uh, the thick fur hood apparently is better than this. How much... This offers a four. That's a six. You can have a five, and I am taking the six. I'm going to look a little bit more ridiculous than we're looking <laughs> so far. But all is well. Okay, everything else is fine. Yeah, we're going to be a little bit um, overburdened, but if we head into Onira here to sell the unnecessary things, so not these things... Those things need to be smelted, like I said. But the boats and everything here. Really, we're still too too heavy. I guess it's the olives, huh? Um, by the way, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're missing something. Miscellaneous. Uh, we're good on grain, beer, butter. We have it. Meat. We have a cheese. Cheese. We don't have. Uh, it's gonna further exceed our capacity, but we have the... Wait, no. That's not all I wanted. But we have the ability to just buy a couple more horses, I would say. Speaking of which... Um, let's see. We have a Darshi horse. Uh, that's also a war mount. It could be useful for uh, unit upgrades later. Those are also war mounts. Let's actually get two more of those. And now a couple of Sumter horses for the um, inventory capacity. There. I'll lock these just so that I don't accidentally sell them. That's going to cost us a little bit, but it's fine. And let's actually get... Uh, we're good on grain beer. We have three. Let's actually get like... Up to 10 butter. You know what? 10 is maybe a little bit too much. Let's get up to 5 instead. Grain. We don't need that much. Uh, fish. 
they don't even have fish. Okay. What did I miss? Cheese. We're on three. I'll have five. Thank you very much. Meat. Five. Uh, grapes. Do you have those? They don't have grapes. Okay. Do you have any olives? They don't have olives either. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, everything else looks dandy. We will end up paying a bit more even, but that's fine. Uh, let's head to the smithy and have you smelt these two. There. And now we're fine. Boom, smithing 15, an additional level, there we go. Um, nothing really to do here anymore. We were literally here at the beginning of the episode. Let's head to the Noomstika and make our way down south, like I said, to get our hands on some additional... Did one of our guys... Oh, no, never mind. One of our guys is just uh, injured. He's not down, down. Mess with us. Yeah, mess with you, and I am wounded. Apparently, I cannot... Okay, it's your lucky day. What do I need, 10%? No, I need more than 10%. Hmm. Oh, uh, the like there's no tournament here, but there is this uh, tavern, so. Onwards we go, Shiba Zuma Castle. So yeah, the plan is collect some more cavalry units here and then head over to Batania, because from what I gathered, the best archer unit that you can possibly have, or one of the best, if not the best, archer unit that you can possibly have is the uh, Batanian Finians. Um, they're very chunky, they're beefy, where if um, enemies actually get up close, their um, range is also not, nothing to scoff at. Like They're just all around brilliant, brilliant units. Um... And I would love to have uh, as many uh, Finians on our side. I'm just curious if uh, I can possibly repeat the um, our success with the Hatamoto Gunners in the Gekko Kujo uh, <laughs> series, where we essentially just completely outgunned the enemy uh, and won the battle through that. Of course, we will also go for um, a sort of a shield wall. Uh, that can soak in the um, inevitable cavalry charges from the enemy. Uh, but I believe we will be quite, quite, quite heavy on the archers. Ju just to see. Um, right, we're, we're not supposed to be in castles. Never mind, we're supposed to be in castle villages. My bad, my bad, my bad. There we go. Recruit troops. And eh, there's one. That's less than I was hoping for. <laughs> Uh, but there's plenty more villages around here. What is this? Party? Yeah, probably just the looters still wanting to join. Uh, recruit troops. Okay, that's an additional one. Okay, Tamnu. Who is... By the way, I'm, I'm guessing the Asarai are the sieging down Lavania over there. None here. Um... Is that a cat connected to a castle? It is. Okay, let's head there. <laughs> Our steward is also going up. <laughs> but the more units we'll have, the faster it'll go. Okay, recruit troops here. There we go. That's a bit more. That's a bit more right there. Uh, you're not... Yeah, you're connected to Razik. Sahel over here is also connected to Sahel Castle. Can we go... I forgot. Do we manage to go through through? No, we don't. We have to go around. Okay, in that case, is that also Castle Village? It's not, but that one is. Before we head to Sahel. Salt mines there. There's a hideout. You know what? Let's actually check over here. What is the mission? Train units. Uh, we won't be doing that right now. Oh, these guys also have a quest. Good, good, good. Let me first recruit a couple of your troops. And then ask you what is up. Bandit base near... Yeah, that's probably that. Uh, I'm not sure if I should take and be these down just yet. Uh, I would rather have a couple of our... Um, even if not completely Finians, at least uh, the lower tier... Archer units, I believe they would come in very, very handy for such raids. What about you in Sahel? What is your mission? The Art of the Trade? Nah. But I will take those two. There we go. We are on 18 troops. 
quite nice, quite nice. Desert Bandits, I believe, actually do consist of some cavalry units, but let's see. We now have 18 units. Yes, they are. Okay, we'll attack and see how this goes. They do, in fact, have plenty of cavalry units. Hopefully we don't lose too many too fast. I was gonna go straight for him. Oh, that's actually already one of our Asura youth down. That was a good hit. Come on, just fall already. Okay, we got him. Let's see if we can possibly throw a couple javelins at these spearmen here. No, 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 I was too slow. No, no, no. Don't hit me too, god. Gosh darn it. Is he the last one? He was the last one. Christ. Okay, so. Uh, maybe I was... A little bit too uh, hypey about attacking desert bandits. We lost three guys. Um, I didn't actually see did our medicine go up at all. It went up by one. I guess that's something. At least our losses are giving us some medicine uh, experience. We did also catch a couple more uh, units here. Our leadership apparently went up, even though we <laughs> essentially lost the units over here. Let's see. Narrow, long-headed spear. Fine steel spear. Uh, the weight is higher. The weapon tier is lower. But both thrust speed and thrust damage are up. The length is down, though, and that's a little bit... The, the handling's nice. You know what? I'll, I'll take it. And I m we might give it to... Um, what's his name? Hamindar... Uh, let's see. I mean... Nah. Nah, 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 nah. I will give it to you, though. I am willing to give you that. Mm, old Sumter Horse. Not even a Sumter Horse anymore. Uh, do we give you, let's see, Balanced jag Jagged Spear. How is that compared to ours? Handling better. Weapon tier even lower. Length. Oh, that's a very, very short spear, actually. Um, I'll give you this as well. Oh, that's some good, fine, guarded, padded fem braces. Can I give you that as well? Good, good, good. Very nice. And you know what? I'll even give you a blunt weapon. Because maybe, just maybe, you might find use for it. Or rather, not might find use for it, but if we ever really want to go out hunting for prisoners and whatnot, that could come in useful. Uh, what did we get? Uh, level and steward, let's see. Wages to our party or food consumption in your party? Uh, recruitment costs as party leader. No morale penalty from having single type of food. Nah, we're gonna go with frugal. Again, this can be changed later. We'll see if it has to be. Uh, this is not a... Oh, oh okay, I thought that said 51. I was like, what? <laughs> right, we've already checked this. Let's just head through the desert here recruit where we can that's a castle right there and we might actually get more recruits here oh there is actually a tournament in Kubiar over here let's head in uh go to the arena join tournament we'll join what's the prize here helmet with open turban all right well like i said i won't be putting another tournament into this episode but uh i'll just do this real quick off camera 
There we go. We actually won. Whew. And uh, I'll admit, I was even more nervous uh, during this one simply because I completely forgot just how low our HP actually was. Um, but hey, we won. We won some additional money that we will basically immediately use for um, additional recruits. We got the helm and we got the renown as well. Um, that's really all there is to this location except for selling these. Helmet with open turban, yeah, definitely taking that one. Uh, and you can have your helm back now. And this one can be sold. There we go. Um, let's see if they actually have the food we need. Uh, grain, we're still on five. Fish, there we go. Bunk, bunk. Let's get five. Butter, we're still on five. Uh, they don't have olives. Mm, that's, a, that's a letdown. But they do have some beer. Let's get some beer. They have some cheese. Do you have any grapes? They don't. We're about to run out of grapes and olives, so we should try to find a location with those. Mm, let's see. Do I get a couple of hardwood? I mean, it's relatively cheap here. Um, no, nah, I think hardwood. We'll go for hardwood uh, once we get to Batania and uh, do some more smithing and whatnot there. Uh, until then, let's just head over here recruit some more actually is that uh i forgot is this yeah it's clay it's clay it's not uh it is not wood uh recruit troops that's what we're going for no wait is this a town village oh it is i thought it was a castle village uh no in fact it is connected to hubiar was it no iakis over there Okay, well, Jamaya. There we go. That's what I was hoping for. Because this is not on the front line. I was hoping that we would get plenty of troops from here. Heck yeah. Okay, now we got 21 of these. How much is our... Yeah, our party wages have gone up quite a bit. But honestly, worth it, worth it, worth it. Now, if only we could... Killian has gained a level, okay. But this is a uh, town village, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Uh, Medini Castle, there we go. I was actually... Let me just check Kosita real quick. No, there's no tournament. For a moment there, I thought maybe, just maybe. We did gain a level. Uh, oh, and this time we also get an attribute point. Um, let's see. Uh, leadership. Well, I think we'll go a point into social here. And you know what? I'll point that, I'll put that focus point into leadership. Increase morale of the parties under your command. Yeah. The experience... The additional experience is definitely going to be nice. Especially for the time when we don't fight. We're not always going to be fighting. Uh, I did say I want like 25 of these, right? Uh, that's... No, that's uh, village, village. Where's your other... Oh, there it is. Okay. I was going to say, where's your... Wait, those are dates? Buy products. Date fruit. We're out of those. So, I would like to buy five date fruits. Thank you very much. We still look good on everything else. Butter chiefs, yeah. Now, all we need is olives. Do you have any grain? You do. Let me just grab one so that we're on five with everything. And you don't have meat. That's fine. Uh, did any of our guys... Yeah, some of our guys are actually willing to upgrade a little bit. Tribal Horsemen. So, Asara Youth, the Tribal Horsemen. We're definitely doing that. Uh, any higher than that, though? For now, I don't think it's necessary just, just yet. Also, yeah, there you can see that it's going to require a war mount to get these guys higher. Uh, but for now, we're going to stick with that. Uh, Kidnar, and after this, we're good to go up north. 
I'll take like two more. So that's 25, just like we set out to do. Uh, we still have plenty of money. Uh, mind you, I I prefer having more, but hey. And now we're paying 114 per day. That is fine. It is somewhat hefty, but it is fine. There is a tournament here. We're at 67%. Should be fine. Let's real quickly see what is up for grabs. Another... Another helm. You know, I was kind of hoping that it would be a horse again, but I'll take it if we can get there. Uh, this, though, worries me. Of course, there's a 4v4. Don't like those. We'll see how it goes. And there we go. We won. I'm not gonna lie. I was sort of shitting my pants <laughs> in the second round. Um, I got up to, like, maybe 5% HP at one point. 5% HP, there were still three of the enemies left, there were only me and other, uh, and um, I think it was the Asarai Light Archer uh, that was also still left, but we managed to somehow pull it through. We managed it, but yeah, that was, that was, that was way too close <laughs> for comfort. There we go, back to 4400. Um, we did get the prize, let's see, uh, inventory, is it actually better than what we have? It is not, but... We can at least give it to our friend here. Let's head into Sanala and sell the headgear he had. There. Let's not forget to lock the cheese. Grain refined, date fruit, beer, olives. You don't have olives here either. You do have meat though, and I am at three of those. So five there. All right. And now, unless there's a tournament in Kuyas, we will head straight back into the uh, Empire Lands and through there into the Batanian Lands, get a few more units. Uh, how are we actually doing on our quests? Establish your clan. We have the Denars, we have the party size. All we need is the 50 Renown. Um, and I'm pretty sure we can do that both via some additional uh, tournaments, as well as possibly some slightly larger battles now that we have a proper amount of, uh, a proper amount of cavalry units, both missile and melee. Uh, but yeah, I think that's going to be it for this episode, guys. So this episode, uh, sorry about the poor showing in the first two uh, tournaments. We managed to win the rest of them. Um, I believe all of them. I believe so. We've finally managed to, like, uh, recruit a substantial enough uh, party of uh, a cavalry units that we don't have to be afraid of riding into somewhat larger battles. Um, but yeah, all in all, once again, like I said at the beginning, let me know down in the comments uh, below, should I just go through the Empire right now, at least through the um, Western Empire here, uh, do a couple of more tournaments if we find any, uh, try and get our renown up so that we're at, uh, tier, clan tier 2, uh, and we can actually continue with the quest line as well as make our way to the Batania, or would you like to basically see the entire process as we go through? Let me know in the comment section down below. Thank you very much for joining me. I will see you next time, and until then, as always, Ad Gloriam.